Welcome back to Designs by Carrie Ann. So uh, today I'm going to do a negative space pour. Um, I think I'm going to do kind of a traveling tree ring technique on this canvas that I painted black. Um, and I'm going to end up with a negative space uh, black, hopefully. <laughs> um, I'm doing this today as part of a Facebook group collaboration and the group's name is Fluid Art Collective. It's an awesome Facebook group. If you're into acrylic pouring, you should check it out. I'll stick the link down in the description below, as well as links to the other artists that are taking part in this collaboration. So, um, yeah, so I've got my uh, 10 by 20 canvas. Like I said, I already coated it um, with um, just Mars Black paint mixed with Floetrol. And um, I'm going to use, I'm going for kind of a metallic uh, color scheme today. So I've got a Deco Art Metallic Champagne Gold, a, an Artist Loft uh, Unbleached Titanium, a Deco Art Worn Penny Metallic, a Deco Art Rose Gold Metallic, and an Artist Loft Copper. And then, uh, of course, this is Mars Black uh, that I coated with. And so I've dumped everything into my cup, looking pretty. And I think I'm going to try and do a river type pattern. We'll see what happens. I've tried a negative pour before and it was on a white background and I wasn't crazy about it, <clears throat> but maybe it'll be cool with a black background. So here we go. We'll see what happens. Up there. I'd like to see how it's running off on the edges. And so far it looks pretty good. And now I'm going to take um, my black, my Mars black paint and sort of uh, make a border around this river that I created to see if I can, carefully, if I can try and blend the two together a little bit. My intention is to grab a straw and blow this uh, paint around a little bit without, <laughs> without trying to cover the entire canvas drop something on my canvas. Doggone it. Okay. It's all right. We can fix that pretty easily. Just go something here. <laughs> and then in trying to pick that up, I made a, made a ding in the paint. I think it's okay. As you know, if you're familiar with um, acrylic pouring and using Floetrol in particular, Floetrol is self-leveling, so if I've got a little bump right now, as it dries and settles, it should level pretty nicely and you won't even notice it. Okay, so I took my black Mars black and put it along the edge of this river and I see I, I'm going to add a little bit more here. I'm just not real confident in this technique. But how else are you going to learn? Okay, so I'm just going to take a straw and sort of blow the, um, the river out a little bit. I think I might like this. Okay, I'm going to take my torch to it. I recently uh, refilled my, my torch with butane, so hopefully it's going to work a little better for me than it had been recently. I don't think I want a whole bunch of cells in this, although it looks like I might get some tiny ones. Itty bitty cells popping up, but I think that's okay. Add a little bit more interest to this. I think I'm gonna stop. Maybe not. I've got one of these old, um, I know it's not old, I guess, but a grill lighter that's got this adjustable um, head on it. 
and sometimes that works pretty a little better than, than my torch, if I can get it to turn on, that is. Boy, what's going on with this guy? <laughs> okay, maybe I won't be using this. It worked the other day. Well, so much for that. Maybe I'm not meant to do anymore with it. Okay, all right, I'm gonna stop and let this guy dry and hopefully it looks halfway decent. I do like the colors though. I don't know if you can see, but it's um, pretty shimmery. Those um, Deco Art metallics create sort of this soft glittery effect and it's very, very pretty. So once that dries, it'll be, it'll be kind of, kind of glimmery where those uh, metallics are, are in the river there. So yeah, okay guys, I think that's it. Not too long of a video. I didn't yammer on too long. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please hit the like button. Um, if you haven't yet, I appreciate it if you subscribe. If you want to see some more of my stuff. And otherwise, you guys take care. Thanks for watching.